Hello and welcome to another Monster Hunter Rise video. Monster Hunter Rise is a game where all hunters come together to fight with some of the most furious and large monsters. To fight them they will need to combine all the armors and weapons that they have. There is where these builds come into effect. When we need more survivability and DPS, we can put it all together in a structure and fight against the monster's speed, ability, power and weaknesses. This is just some build that I feel comfortable with. Uh, this is just a guide and you won't have to follow the total build. However, feel free to change any of the jewels if you don't have them. Uh, as this is the end game content anyway. So without further ado, let's go to our first build. Uh, our first one, our first one is a raw attack build. Uh, it's clearly built on a, a raw attack. So for this build, I've used Abel Me and Abel um, Great Sword with 230 attack, 20 ice elemental attack, and minus 11% affinity. And as a rampage slots, I've selected affinity boost one, so it gives a little bit plus affinity on there. Um, I've also used Barrel of Helm, um, Fake Mill, Rathalos Braces, Scalda Electra, that's how you say it, um, Ignored Graves, Demon Petalets, and a Fatal Tempest Talisman. Um, let's move on to the jewels I've used in there. So altogether I've used um, two attack drills, uh, three charger drills, uh, remember they slots into uh, two, uh, level two slots so you're only going to have a few uh, and three frost drills as mm, those are the f only three level one drill slots I had. Um, after you put everything together as a skill we're going to have uh, attack boost level seven Weakness exploit level 3, ice attack level 3, which is not really relevant for this build anyway, but I thought I'll ramp up the uh, attack a little bit more, the elemental side of it. Um, then we're going to have focus level 3, critical eye level 2, offensive guard level 1, load shells, uh, which is not really needed in this build. Again, uh, def defense boost uh, is a, a byproduct of the armors. Amazing, and when you have everything together, we'll have a total attack of 263, uh, elemental attack of 25, affinity minus 1%, and defense of th uh, 314. Uh, it's a little bit stronger against fire, water, and dragon element, and a little bit weaker on thunder and ice elements. Okay, jumping on to our second build, uh, I'd like to call it a crit uh, build. Uh, it's all about critical attacks. So for this build, I've used Dark of Night um, with the Rampage slot uh, attack boost level 3. And um, I also use Golden uh, Headdress, Anzen of Mel, Kamura Braces. Golden Obi, Golden Hakama, Fatal Tempest Talisman. Um, on this build, I've only used um, two expert jewels. Um, that gives me a critical eye and uh, charge jewel level two. I mean, that's only slots I have available for uh, level two jewels. Um, and I have a fair amount of things about level. Uh, six of them level one jewel slots um, that you can use for anything really you feel comfortable with um, so it is quite a flexible build um, when you put them all together I'll have critical eye level 4 heroic level 4 critical boost level 3 focus level 3 maximum might level 2 weakness exploit level 1 latent power level 1 marathon runner level 1 and load shells which is not really relevant for this build again and when we put everything together um, I'll have a total attack of 188 um, there is no elemental attack 
affinity of 55%, uh, defense 341, fire resistance, uh, water resistance, thunder resistance, dragon resistance, pretty high, but it's very weak against fire resistance, so, uh, ice resistance, I mean, but obviously you can slot some more more jewels in there and um, you can overcome that bit. And last but not least, uh, this is my third build, I would like to call it uh, Elemental Build. Uh, for this build I've used uh, Red Wing 2, uh, which have 190 attack, sharpness fair amount, uh, 42 fire elemental attack, and for the rapid slot I've used Fire Boost 1. Um, for this build I've also used Aelipath Vectrex, Aelipath Thorax, Kamura Braces, Golden Obi, Golden Hakama, Fatal Tempest Talisman and I've used 5 Blaze Jaw uh, which slots into level 1 uh, slots and um, uh, Expert Jaw which is slots into level 2 Jaw slots. Um, when you put them everything together, you will have a critical eye level 6, fire attack level 5, critical boost level 3, a critical element level 3, botanist level 2, uh, it's a byproduct of the armors, heroic level 2, latent power level 1, maximum might level 1. And when you combine everything together, um, all together will have 190 attack. A fire elemental attack of 54, 30% uh, affinity, defense of 339. It's uh, a lot stronger against fire, water, thunder, and dragon elements, but uh, again, a little bit weaker against ice element. But we can overcome that easily. Um, that is all the builds, guys. I uh, hope you have enjoyed the video and. Um, I really appreciate it. show you some support to the channel if you do like the videos um, it's totally up to you and thank you for watching have a nice day